Originally, the call came in as an attempted abduction, but now West Hartford police are saying that they're calling it a suspicious incident, very unusual, odd. Three people in a dark-colored Honda pulled up to a girl on her way to high school. And they said, do you want to ride, repeatedly asking her to get in the car. It really puts you in touch with the reality of, you know, what we're dealing with in this society. I'm shocked and I'm, I'm nervous at the same time. Tonight, parents scared but thankful for the email that was sent home to Conard High School students. It happened in broad daylight, 9.15 in the morning, two blocks from the school. Police say two Hispanic males and one Hispanic female with a white fluffy dog pull up to a young student walking to class. They keep asking her over and over if she wants to get in and have a ride. Evidently, they asked her repeatedly if she wanted a ride, and she adamantly said no and refused. Um, unknown if it's related, but a uh, small silver pickup also sort of pulled up. Police immediately canvassed the area looking for the older, dark-colored Honda. And while they didn't find it, police say the students are taught at a young age in school what to do if they are approached. What do you do if a stranger comes up? Um, you remember, report, and run. You remember the license plate and remember the vehicle, what the person looks like. You run away and then you report it to your parents and eventually the police. Well, it happened this morning at Conard. The same scenario has played out at other West Hartford schools with different drivers. By my school once and then when I was um, by my elementary school too. So it happens a lot. Police say the student did exactly the right thing. Not only did she get out of there quickly, but she reported it to police. They just ask that when you make that report, make it as soon as you can get to a phone to call 911. I'm Bob Wilson, on the scene in West Hartford, News 8.